Hey everyone, this is going to be my second Google -Go Girlfriend video and unfortunately my last. I've been having um, a lot of problems with the site. A lot of the times when I um, update my information and it'll log me out mysteriously. I received, um, actually didn't receive some products that were on my register of things to receive. And a lot of the things just seem really unprofessional and it's not the same quality that I've received from uh, Test Tube and Birchbox. So I decided to cancel it because I was, for less money, I was getting a Birchbox. And even though you get less full size products, I can hear the kids screaming in the background, you, it's just more put together. It's usually more professional. And what really took me over the edge is that I got my November box in December. And that was just not good. And they didn't even send me an email until I asked them about it, which Birchbox, um, if you guys, some of you guys know, the West Coast received those a little bit late, and we received uh, 10 Birchbox points. Or, actually, you know, 100 Birchbox points would equal 10 Birchbox dollars. So, let's go ahead and get into what I got. This time I did get a card. My first Go Girlfriend. I did not. And it has a list of the things that I got. And once again, it is wrong. This says here that my scent got changed from vanilla to rose water. I don't know if you guys have ever smelled rose water products before, but they smell pretty grandmaish to me. And I also did not receive the Dolce & Gabbana fragrance in light blue. So I'll show you what I did get. First is the Camille Beckman French Vanilla, or I'm sorry, Rose Water. And I would like the scent, but like I said, it smells grandmash. Everyone pretty much got the same Google Girlfriend. There was not much variety from the videos that I have seen, which does not explain the delay in the services. So I got this. I think it retails on their site for $10. I got this, and it has been leaking like crazy. I haven't even had the chance to use it. Just for me walking this over from the bathroom where I had it stashed on my medicine cabinet, I've gotten oil everywhere from the olive oil. So, I'm not even going to open it for you guys. Sorry. Um, next, instead of the Dolce & Gabbana fragrance, I got a scent by Izzy Miyake. And I'm really not into uh, fragrance samples at all. For some reason, I really just don't like uh, fragrance samples. Let's spray it. Smells to me grandma ish. I, once again, it's really strong, really perfumey, like a musty smell. I'm sure you guys have seen, I guess there was not a lot of variation in the video, so I'm sure you guys have seen reviews on this. I also got a full size, this is probably one of the saving graces, is this Blossoms eyeshadow. I don't like how you can see it gets all around the rim, but this green color in Dreamy Girl. And I'll just watch it. I know that my lighting is bad, but green is my favorite eyeshadow to put on. And once you blend it out, it turns into like a turquoise color. And last but not least, I did get an e.l.f. eyeshadow crease brush. And it is a pretty firm brush. I have a blending brush, which I use for my crease. And this one is really, really firm. I tried to put it. I used it the other day, actually. And it's I could it's not very good for blending. <laughs> so it's really good for really intricate lines and detailing. That's what I would use it for. But this is um pretty good brush. Uh Elf to me, I either love the products or I hate them. A few of my brushes I really, really like, but a few of them the tip has come off. So I am going to save up and invest in some higher quality brushes in the future, but I'm going to just um, recap by showing you guys the card. Oh, I'm sorry, and I also got the um, Crystal Essence Mineral Deodorant Towelettes. I also got one of these. I have got these in a sample 
of uh, girls checking girls night out. I had a huge grab bag from that event and erased the video. And by that time, I'd given stuff away, opened things, and it just wasn't going to be the same quality of video. But I got one, two, three, four, five, six things. Um, two of which I think are usable, I would say. This I'm going to have to pay someone to take because the smell is just not, not at all nice. <laughs> Sorry for the, um, just lackluster video. I'm just really disappointed in the service and maybe once they um, are around for a while, they'll get better, but Go Go Girlfriend just isn't really something that I'm going to be into. So, bye bye Go Go Girlfriend, and I am hoping to sign up for My Glam. I missed the subscription, but hopefully by the um, beginning of next month, I'll be able to sign up for that and show you guys that video. So, leave your comments below and let me know um, how your Go Go Girlfriend experience has been. Bye.